So guys, we'll learn our first machine learning algorithm, which is called a simple linear regression. This is a super important algorithm because the techniques that we are going to learn in this will also be applicable in deep learning when you're probably learning the first neural network, which is called an artificial neural network, right? So it is super important. We try to understand this. And remember this machine learning algorithm, I'll try to break down this into separate, separate modules so that you can understand it in a better way. Now, what kind of problem statements do we solve with simple linear regression? As the name suggests regression, so definitely in supervised machine learning technique, if you have a regression problem statement, we can definitely solve it with the help of simple linear regression. Now, what exactly simple linear regression algorithm are all about? Let's say that I have a specific and easy data set. Okay, let's say I have a data set and this particular data set has features like age and probably weight or instead of writing age and weight, let's basically just write something like weight and height. Okay. Now, as I said, regression problem statement, obviously I will be having some data parts. Let's say uh, if the weight is somewhere around 74 kgs, my height may be 170 centimeters. If the weight is 80 kgs, the height may be 180 centimeter. If the uh, weight is somewhere around 75 kgs, the height may be 175.5 centimeters. Let's say this kind of data set I have. Okay. Now in this particular data set, our main aim is that we need to train a model and this specific model, whenever we give our new weight, new weight, it should be able to predict the height. Okay. This should be able to predict the height. And now you just see this. Okay. So this feature is basically our independent features independent features and this feature is specifically our output or dependent feature okay dependent feature so this is what we are planning to do and this model that we are going to train is with the help of simple linear regression okay simple linear regression now why do we say it as simple linear regression understand over here how many input features we have over here we just have one input feature and one output feature. Whenever we just have just one input feature, then we say it as simple linear regression. If we probably have multiple input feature, then we can basically call it as multiple linear regression. But it is very important to just understand simple linear regression, then automatically whatever terminologies and maths that you probably will learn in this will get applied to multiple linear regression also. Okay. So in short, uh, what are we trying to do? Uh, as I said, for this specific model, we will train it. We will train it with this specific data. Okay. And later on this model, whenever it takes new weight should be able to predict the height. Okay. If I really want to show you in a geometric way, what are we trying to do? Let's say this is my weight and this is my height. Okay. Now with respect to this particular data set, let me plot some points. Let's say there are some points which is plotted like this. Okay. So with the help of simple linear regression, what we are trying to do is that we'll try to create a best fit line. Okay. And this best fit line will actually help us to do the prediction for the new weight. So let's say, how does the prediction happen? Let's say once we get this best fit line, Okay. And this best fit line should be created in such a way that, you know, that the distance between the true, true points, the so true points basically means these are my true uh, output, right? These are all of my true output, 170 centimeters, 180 centimeters, 175.5 centimeters. So the distance between this and this predicted point, this and this predicted point, distance between this and this predicted point, this and this predicted point, this and this predicted point this and this predicted point. If I do all this distance, and this is basically the error, right? Because these are my true points and these are my predicted points. So right now, just understand till here, I will again explain in more detail, right? So this distance should be, if I do the summation of this distance, it should be minimal. And that is the technique we basically use to select the best fit line. Now, once we create this best fit line, whenever we get a new data point, let's say with respect to this particular weight, how do we predict our output? What should be the height? All we do is that we try to 
just put this line on this particular C and we just try to see where this point meets this particular line, which is my best fit line. This is basically my best fit line. Okay. And then we try to see where in the Y axis it is basically meeting. Okay. So suppose if it is meeting at this particular point, so this specific is my output for this specific weight. This is what we actually do in simple linear regression. Okay. Over here, the main is that we just try to create a best fit line such in whenever we give our new weight, we should be able to predict what should be the height. Okay. Now, as we go ahead, uh, let's understand what is the mathematical equation of this particular best fit line. And when I spoke about this error, what is this specific error? We'll also try to understand and we'll try to understand in a very amazing way. Okay. So let's go ahead into the next video. Thank you.